Hello YouTube, this is Vine2480. I'm here to do the review on the Hollywood Nails Kit that I showed you all. I bought this from Bed Bath & Beyond. It was $19.99. Um, the kit comes with seven stamping plates. And in the middle of each plate, you use that for your toes. So each one has a big image in the middle for your toes. And I have some more. They came in this um, white container. The other one was in the front of the kit for you to see as an example. And they also have a backing on the back of each one of them. This one has like a candy cane and a bow on it. And this one has like flower images. And this one has like a seashell, snowman, a palm tree. And some butterflies. It also came with this um, art brush on this end and then with a dotting tool on this end. And then it came with some a rhinestone wheel. It has like just random shapes inside of it. And then it came with this. This is where you put your image plate on right there and this is the stamper and then when you slide the image forward this is the scraper that's inside of it so you can pop it back in and you can take it out so you could clean it and then you could take this out so you can use the stamper for your toes but I'm going to show you how to use it if you would like to see please stay tuned Okay, everyone, you seeing me using this uh, for the first time. I painted my nails with random colors on it. This is a pink color by Zoya, and it's called Low. And on this one, it's like a neon color by China Glaze, and it's Japanese neon. And on this one, it's, I used the color by Sally Hansen, Hardest Nails Extreme Wear. And this one is the Real Teal 480. And on this hand, I did a purple. This one is by Finger Paints, and it's called Beach Bound. And then a dark blue by Sally Henson Hardest Nails, blue it. And then a black by Wet n Wild, it's just a regular black, black cream. Okay, I'm going to use, it also came with some instructions how you should do it. It tells you to choose image plate with desired image. If this is the first time using the plate, remove protective covering. The center designs are exclusively for use on toes. Place machine on clean, flat surface and push handle forward to lock in place. So this is the handle. So it's going to lock in place. Okay, if it doesn't work, then you have to rotate it. And then step three, it says position your finger in the nail guide and line up C-line with the line of the nail. Okay, down here it has, it says C-line right here. And this is the nail guide for your nails. And then you can lock it in place. Okay. 
and then it says twist to secure so you line your nail up with the C line then you make sure it's locked in place okay number four place image plate and holder Okay, with desired image facing to the back of the machine, like I told you earlier, and, and apply polish to the image. I have some random polishes out here. One, um, this is a Conad, a light blue. I have the Conad yellow, the Conad red, and I have this color by Sinful Colors. And it's called Folly. And then I also have the cone at white. And I might just use the other polishes that I showed you earlier. I'm going to start with this nail. It has the real teal by um, Sally Hansen on it. And I guess I'm going to try maybe this yellow by Conan, okay? And depending on the length of your nails, you're going to have to line the C, line it up with the C line differently. So I hope it lines up well. So you just push it forward, then you press it down, then you pull it back. And you stamp the image onto your nail. It's okay. I don't know if you can see that real good. It kind of is at the top of my nail. So I'm going to try it again. Get a, um, some cleaner and a remover to get it off. I'm using remover by Zoya. And I'm going to clean it off. And I'm going to pop this out. So I can clean it off. Then I'm going to pop it back in. And then you pop that back out. And clean it off. And pop it back in. Okay, now I'm going to paint on this neon nail. I guess I'll use this blue by Conan and I'll pick a different image. Push it forward and you press the stamper down. And then you pull it back. Stamp it onto your nail. Maybe I'm not lining it right up right with that on uh, C line. So let me practice off camera and I'll be back. But this is how it looks. I mean, it's working fairly well. But it's not going all the way down on my nail like I want it. So maybe I'm doing something wrong. So I'll be back. Okay, everyone, I'm back. I tried it again off camera. I'm really not liking this kit. But I'm going to um, try some smaller images. Because it seems that they are not going down far enough on my nail. Maybe it's me, user error. And I'll keep on practicing. But I'm going to try these images. This image right here. Looks like some, I don't know, little circles. But I'm going to try that and see on camera. Because I've been trying it and trying it. And I'm not really liking how it is turning out. I'm going to use the black.
Okay, the smaller images turned out pretty good. I'm going to do another one. Maybe I wasn't pulling it back far enough, but... I may give the kid away. I don't know. Because I'm not really liking it. I don't know if you can see the candy cane or not. I'm going to do it again on my um, other finger so you can see it. It's okay. I'm not really liking this Hollywood kit like the TV claims it out to be. But if anybody else have had success with it. Please let me know because I'm not really liking it. I like the plates. I can just use the plates by themselves. So that's a plus. Let me use this color by Simple Colors. It's folly. Folly. You can't even see the image. Sorry about that. You can't even see the image. See, sometimes it seems like it gets stuck. I don't want to push forward. So I'm going to put this as a fair review. I am not liking it. The only plus is the plates. I'm going to get a Conan stamper and stamp them without this machine. Because I'm not liking it at all. Okay, I did uh, this image right here. Using the yellow polish by Conan. And I just used the scraper and stamper. And it, the image came out well. But I do not like that machine with this. And I'm going to stamp some on camera so you all can see. But I do not like the machine with it. I will keep the place. But I do not like that machine. That's what I get for watching TV and think I like something that's on TV. Everything they claim that works on TV doesn't always work. <sighs> I hate it didn't work, but I don't know if you could see that image or not. I'm going to do a different plate. I like the plates, but... And the rhinestones and the brush that came with the kit. But the machine, they could have left. They came out good. Watching this video, you guys. And if you have any questions, comments, or concerns, please leave them below. And like I said, if you know anybody who's had success with this, please let me know so I can watch their video so I can get better. Because I guess it's just user error, but I don't like it. So, I thank you for watching. Take care and be blessed. If you And, um... Rate, comment, and subscribe. Thanks for watching again.